Hi everyone, welcome back to my uh, channel and I have to say to everyone it's been a long time, I haven't seen you guys for a long time and uh, my channel suffer a few transformations um, I went from our studio Transylvania to totally Enoch studio uh, sounds more professional and more related to what I actually do in the background, in my garage, downstairs everywhere as I move location nowadays so totally Enox studio from now on I'm very glad now to present you one of my uh, favorite uh, pieces of art of uh, Konstantin Brankush I have recently tagged together which I invite you all to do it uh, it's a representation and of the endless column of uh, Konstantin Brinkush. It's an indoor art piece, and uh, I like to show you all the technical details how you guys can do it. I'll uh, start welding a little bit and uh, polishing it in this uh, little movie. Uh, this column is very dear to me, and I would like um, to invite you guys to do this column as many people around the world as possible to bring uh, Konstantin Brankush in our lives and in every house around the world. He's um, very dear to me and he's an uh, inspiration. And I hope you guys agree by working on such things. You can do it in your shed, in your garage or in any studios. Another thing I want to ask everyone around the world, if anybody's interested in a partnership, I'm... Um, I'm really interested on joining. If there are uh, any um, design groups or architects groups which would like me to join you and create my arts, indoor, outdoor pieces like this or more, I'll be very happy. Please drop me an email and I'm very open to a collaboration being even local or national or international, I'll be very happy to put the use of my skills and my passion together with you guys. So Totally Enoch Studio through George is open to any collaborations. I'll be taking this uh, little column downstairs and uh, I'll show you the fact it's uh, made by uh, several elements which individually I'm gonna weld and polish. Like every single element is dismantable and I'll be welding and polish and then I'll be welding them together and will look really beautiful. I'll probably have uh, the opportunity to show you the, the end artwork in the next video. So thank you very much to all my subscribers, all my friends during these years who supported me. Uh, more artwork made of stainless steel, inox, will be posted on my channel from now on. My channel will be now, as I said, totally inox studio. Thank you very much and please stay tuned with me. I'll be posting more from now on. Thank you. Hope Hi. to see you soon. I brought you down here in my little place, my new place I got where I work. And I'll present you the sizes I used into creating the elements of uh, my Brinkusian column. As you can see the top, I got 95 millimeter. The bottom size I got 185 millimeters. And the total height, 190. So I created a template out of cardboard and then I mark it on a piece of stainless steel piece of inox and I created the template from cardboard creating these I've been able to create the long ones by having them together 
and to fold them, I uh, to cut them, I use my little bench here. Cut them as close as possible to the size, and to fold them, I use the big, big, thick steel plate. Slide them under, and with my hands, I just gave it the fold I needed to get this done. The top piece, as you can see, is only half of the uh, main element. So this is the top piece. The bottom piece has got this element plus half of its height here. So it's a polygon plus the element. So for stability, this Albert Kush has built his column. Uh, it's a beautiful uh, piece of art and totally inox studio uh, will reflect uh, uh, the master of modern arts, Konstantin Brankush, through this beautiful column. You guys uh, should do it at home. If I can do it in this little setup here, everybody can do it. If you got a workshop, a studio, uh, it's much easier. It was easy for me. Every single element, it's only tapped, it's not fully welded. That's why it's not to his final um, uh, work. Has, uh, weld, welding has to be done all along. And then polishing. And then once I weld and polish every single element, I'll just have to join them together as quick, as, as good as possible and I'll build them up and then I'll have to weld, fully weld around. Of course a bit of polish of the welds around and um, I'm confident it will look great and you guys should get the same result with this little template if you get the sizes. Um, the thickness of the inox I used is 1.2 millimeters. 1.2 millimeters. It's a process which shouldn't take too long, a few days of continuous work or maybe a few weeks if you work a little bit. It took me a few weeks because I didn't proceed doing the work in a large amount of hours every day, so I took my time. It's the result of a uh, passion I have for Konstantin Brankush. All right. Um, Welcome back, as I said, to Totally Inox Studio nowadays and looking for partnership, as I said, designing companies, architects around the world, uh, a partnership local, national in Australia, artwork studios who would like to uh, have me as in a partnership, uh, international if uh, you guys consider myself and uh, my work and my ability to uh, work on Inox um, important. I'll be more than happy to join. Drop me an email, please don't forget. Uh, and we can talk from there and we can take from there. To all my subscribers and everybody I haven't seen for ages, from the bottom of my heart, I'm glad to see you again. I shall bring more videos and show you more artwork to encourage everyone who loves stainless steel, who loves creation of Master Constantin Brankush. To show you how easy and how much you can do with uh, this beautiful uh, trade of TIG welding. Alright, I'll get back to work and I'll show you the welding of one element. Let's do it.
one of the elements being welded will take longer to weld the rest of them. The polishing process is pretty long as well, but uh, on my next video I'll present you the end product of this beautiful column, Brancusian column. Uh, stay tuned from, for more uh, videos from brand new Totally Inox Studio uh, by George here in uh, camera. Uh, I hope you're gonna enjoy this column. You got all the sizes for a beginning to start working on your new column. Don't hesitate by looking at it and uh, place this project for later on. Just do it now. It will be a pleasure for you, and it is a pleasure for me to give you something. So, looking again for partnership, as I said, locally, nationally, or internationally. Total Enoch Studio. Thank you guys for your trust and patience. I hope to see you soon. Stay tuned for more from Total Enoch Studio here in Canberra.